Hi, this is Ken Block, WRC and Jim Connor driver. I'm here in lovely Melbourne, Australia at Calder Raceway to do a little car swap. So we have my Jim Connor 3 car over here that I'm going to swap with an Australian V8 supercar Ford Falcon. Basically a dream come true for me because the series down here in Australia is one of my favorite car championships in the world and it's a, a car that I've always wanted to drive. Can't wait. G'day, I'm Mark Winterbottom, driver of the number five Orcon Steel FPR Falcon in the V8 Supercar Championship here in Australia. We get to do the Ken Block experience. So I get to drive his Ford Fiesta and then we strap him into one of our muscly V8 supercars, which is going to be a completely different experience, I'm sure, to what he's used to. So yeah, I want to see what he can do in our car and I want to have a have a play in his and see what his car does as well. Quite good. It's, uh, it's funny when you see him actually drive, you know, a typical racing line. Uh, he's obviously very good and understands, you know, car control and, and what to do with it that way. But as soon as he gets it into a slide or or uh, trying to control the car in a slide the way a four-wheel drive car works, he uh, it goes counterintuitive. He does what he does with a rear-wheel drive car. So you got to kind of unlearn some things that you know from driving other types of cars when you, when you jump in this thing it's quite different but it is good for being in a completely unfamiliar setting and then and try it out it did well it was um that was also completely different to obviously what we do here but um the hardest thing is to when you drive our cars you correct the steering wheel so opposite lock and try and drive out of it where this one you opposite lock and get on the throttle it understeers so um the two race cars that are driven completely different and that um, that's the hardest thing to come to grips with is trying to stay on the throttle, keep the steering wheel straight and drive around it. It's um, completely different. Awesome fun. Awesome fun. Plenty of smoke, a lot of noise. Can't wait for him to drive ours because it is completely different. I'm trying to give him a few pointers. Get used to the uh, only the rear wheels driving. Used to the extra 400 kilos. I try and drive it straight, not sideways, so <laughs> he'll be right, I think. Full faith. <laughs> that was actually the most interesting driving experience on a track I think I've ever had. I, uh, it's it goes against everything that I try and do in a car, which braking early and getting momentum and flowing through the corner. Uh, I spun in the first corner because that's exactly what I tried to do. And when I got on the throttle, just even in the tiniest bit, the car spun. <laughs> I wasn't doing anything. It was a, a very interesting learning experience. I couldn't believe it spun. Yeah, yeah. I, was, I, I barely even touched the throttle. I was just dumbfounded by that. The setup of the car, the gearbox, the engine, the power delivery, it's actually quite amazing. But it just drives unlike anything I've ever experienced in my life. So I got a little more used to it there at the end, but it, uh, it, it would definitely take me a while to kind of unlearn everything I've been trying to learn over the last couple of years to adapt to this. So, uh, but I, I enjoy it though. It's a fun little track, and uh, it's a definitely an amazing car they have. Oh, he did well. He's not scared, that's for sure. He, you know, he picked up the basics pretty quickly. But I think it's pretty foreign to what he's used to. It goes against everything he's he's learnt. You know, he was just uh, you know working up to it. He had one quick spin on his outlap, which was a bit of a laugh. I think it shocked him. He couldn't couldn't believe what happened because, it, as I said, it's the very opposite to what he does in his car. You've got to not get on the throttle in the corner, you've actually got to wait a little bit with all this weight and uh, all the power, you've got to really wait till the car's straight till you can get on the throttle aggressively. Uh, so that caught him out pretty quick. Um, but no, he was good, you know, you can, you know, he's obviously a, a guru driver and, um, you know, it was a privilege to sit alongside someone like him and uh, for him to enjoy my office and, um, you know, a few more runs, I think he'd, he'd certainly uh, get better and better. <laughs> I think we're both a bit sceptical uh, to drive each other's cars. He'll look after me and tell me what to do and 
Oh, I can go and be uh, a bit out of control for once, so uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to letting my hair down and uh, hopefully getting a bit of smoke. <laughs> that was cool, it was uh, certainly a different experience to, to what I'm used to, but um, yeah, I had a smile on my face the whole time. I couldn't stop laughing, actually. I was pretty impressed by the launch. The shifts, the gearbox was really nice and, and just had, had really good grip. So, um, very different world to what I'm used to. A lot of fun. All right, well, it's the end of the day. It was a lot of fun swapping cars. This, this, <laughs> this nice gentleman here let me drive his car, even though I know nothing about what I'm doing on circuit, circuit cars. But uh, I struggled really hard in your car. It, it was genuinely a very fun car to drive, but finding the limits of those tires, a lot of respect on what this guy does. He didn't so, struggle. He was good. He was good. Well, thank you. You're very kind of saying that, but I spun in the first corner. Come on. They're uh, different skills. They're yeah, different skills. Quite, They're complete opposite, huh? Quite different. You did You did very good in my car. I was very impressed. <laughs> Tried to get smoke. Got as much as I could, but <laughs> I couldn't nearly do what he did. That was phenomenal. That was a crazy day. Awesome fun. Yeah, well, I think the end of the day, too, having a little uh, drift session around the track, following each other, I think that was really the highlight of my day, though. I've never actually drifted my car that, that close to a very expensive race. Oh, I've never looked in the mirror and saw the back of a car catching me. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was different. That is cool. He's a man, he's a man. I trusted him though, he wasn't he wasn't gonna hit it. Thanks again for uh, Thank you. coming out and playing. My pleasure, it's awesome, thanks. <laughs>